Here's what I'm going to suggest for your ear. Just basically stay off of it. Use your left ear to talk in the phone. If you need to, for some reason, favor an ear, favor the left one. Don't use the phone for my right ear? Yeah. I mean, you just want to limit the amount of noise that goes into it. You want me to talk lefty? Yeah. Let's just talk lefty. I have a hard time talking lefty on the phone. Everything comes out wrong. It's like throwing lefty. I can't do it. I'm not myself. I feel different, strange, like I'm not me. I don't, I'm not comfortable talking lefty. All I can do is give you my expert uh, opinion. Fine, I'll, okay? I'll... So that's what I'm suggesting. I'm suggesting you stay off the right ear. Okay, fine, I'll talk lefty. Is uh, Richard there? Uh, no, he's not. Uh, is this Larry? Yeah. This is Cha-Cha. Ah! Cha-Cha. <laughs> Hi, Larry. You just caught me in the middle of a workout. So I'm calling about the movies? <sighs> yeah, the movies, right. You know, we were talking about, wouldn't it be great if we could all go to a really nice dinner in one of those fancy schmancy joints? Okay, I'll, I'll tell, uh, I'll tell uh, Cheryl. Great. What are you wearing? What am I wearing right now? Yeah, what are you wearing? You're making me uncomfortable, Larry. <sighs> I'm, I'm gonna hang up right now. I'm gonna hang up right now. Goodbye. Bye. Auntie Ray! Don't blame this on me, Auntie Ray! You know about Mary? They don't know nothing about no birds and trees. Hey, David, come down here. Pervo, come down here. You fucking pervo. What? You fucking pervo. You really hit the depths. The fucking door. How else do you think I got it? This kid's got to stop leaving the door open, man. Yeah, this is it. You know, if I didn't know you my whole life, I'd fucking, you know what? I'd attack you right now. What are you talking about? You call my girlfriend and hit on her and she doesn't respond and you fucking get her fired? You fucking piece of shit. First of all, I never hit on her. And what are you talking about, fire? Bert's dad at the barber shop, you made that fucking miscarriage remark. So he fired her because because he wants nothing to do with anybody that knows you. Oh, is what he supposed to be getting back at me? Who are you to tell him how many kids to have? Oh, she's got nine kids. I'm, come on, that's But she wants more children. How many does she need? Who the fuck are you, the Messiah? You account? know what? I got news for you. It's enough. By the way, you know, in China, you're allowed two. Those people would be killed in China. What? China what? Two. Two babies in China. What happens if you have three? They execute you. They kill the baby? Not the baby, idiot. They kill the parents. Get out of here. Well, maybe they don't execute, but they give, they give you a good dressing down, okay? How dare you lose my girlfriend's job. She lost her health insurance. She has really? no self-worth anymore. She lost her self-worth? That's right. She uh, lost her self-worth. Really? You get on that goddamn telephone, and you get my girlfriend's job back. You call Bert and get that, and you apologize. Okay. I'll make that call on the one condition. I want to be able to use your bathroom on the way to work in the morning. He's my, sit on my toilet? Yeah. There's no fucking way. Why? Nobody sits on Richard Lewis's toilet. Use every toilet in the that's house? That's right, I rotate. Wait, I can't use the basement? No, that's for weekends. I have no place to go to the bathroom. I can't go here, I can't go at work. You just make the goddamn call, you owe me. Jesus Christ. I, I'll try, I mean, that's all I can yeah, do. fine. Just get her a job back. What are you doing? I want a righty call, what's this lefty bullshit? I want a righty call. Jesus Christ. Hello? Oh, hey, Barbara. Yeah? Hey, it's Larry David. Oh, hi, Larry. 